Welcome back to another interesting episode on the continuation of railing and rabbit. Okay, we stopped here the other time in the other class. Okay, we stopped at something like this. So let's try making this our rail parametric. First of all, open up another family. Okay, and this time around, I want a generic line based family and say okay that's nice now bring up that my family which is this load it into my oh, okay here it is load it into my this please okay now click on escape i would like to move this further apart Okay, and now align this guy to this. Lock it in place. Now align this one to this, and now lock it in place. Okay, so now I like to array this guy. Then see array, click on last, and now pick up this endpoint here. So, oh, I forgot about something. Let's just leave it. Okay, so I would like to pick it to this place. Now align this place. Okay, basically, I am not supposed to put this post here because, um, for instance, if I'm going to join. This, I'm, I'm going to join it so it will be this post there is no post here and the post here joins to this place so basically you are going we're going to use this post at, at the end of this but no problem let's see if it's going to look fine with the two posts there okay so I have my array now let's create some parameters new para oh, sorry new parameter let's call it a make it an instance parameter for array a for array and now I'm finished okay so good now I have this now create another one for the length so first of all cancel I would like to know the actual length of this which is from here sorry not a line length from here all the way to this place I believe it should be 1950 that's okay so let's make it 1900 okay so go to this create another make it name it L make it an instance parameter also finish so the length which is L I want it to be 1900 and now see length divided by L total length divided by L okay which is this divided by this all right so length divided by L capital L so it's case sensitive you need to be very careful about it so now you can see I have three array okay so which means my work is done here let's save it control s I think I should name it rel4 Okay, number four. Four. Alright, so finish. Okay, that's nice. Now let's open up another project. Make it architectural and now uh, open.
Good. Bring up my really info and now load it into project one. I will try applying it on both places. I will try applying it on normal flow and that of um, what's the name? Stakies. And let's see if our work is done correctly. Let me just make it small. Now finish. Um, for the stakies, I want stairs. Mm hmm. Let me edit some few things on um, the side. I want it closed. Width of 100. Let's make it 100. Okay. Finish. Um, yeah, closed. The right support this is the left support I want a let's just put both of them and I prefer one which one is the right which one is the left hmm. I'm going to find out later <laughs> because I can't really say this is I want this one to be open and say okay I don't want risers. Just make it stylish. Okay, so let's make it straight round as I can. Okay, and I'll finish it up. Who is Mr. Right and who is Mr. Left? Got it ready? Let's see. Okay, with I think I added one thousand. I don't know. Yeah, I added 1000. <laughs> and let's see, the add 100, and I want it to be yeah, closed. It's okay, so this one is the one I want it to be open. Hmm. No. Closed. Open. Okay, that is what I want, and that is it. So let's delete this one and let's delete this one. Okay, so the reason why I left this here is because I want to use this face. Um, check, click on face. This is a face based. Okay, use a face based family. So Um, you don't tap a couple of times and uh, sorry, you don't tap a couple of times and uh, let's see if it comes out correctly or not. Okay, so this is what is going on. I don't think it's going to follow up to my staircase. Okay, so control Z. I don't think it's going to do so, but I believe. It will follow up my this bot is not going to follow up my staircase so 
Mm, later on, if I check out how to make this in follow my stake, yes, I believe I'm going to show you. But for now, you can see we have something like this. And believe me, I never thought it's going to look this fine. Oh, let's go realistic. I never thought it's going to look this fine. But it's really looking very fantastic. So guys, this is the way to create a parametric railing that works only on flat surface. So when I figured out a way to make it work on an inclined surface, I will definitely show you that also. So let's see same time tomorrow. But how can you tell me that this is not going to work on? Let me check it again. It's slowing down. Let me check it again and see. But seriously, after all this hassle, I'm supposed to see this work. Delete this one. Delete it. Okay, let's see something here. Component um flow no problem okay so component let's pick up this and all the way to the top there let's see if it's going to work I don't know if it is Place on face. It's a face based family. It's supposed to attach to the face. I don't know why it's not. So, mission not totally complete. Wonderful. Now, I am a bit impressed but not completely. Why am I not completely impressed? You can see this is a problem here which is, is not going up straight. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> it's not going up straight. So at least we were able to create something that works all the way to the top. Thank God it's working. Okay. So at least we have something a bit okay. So guys, let's see same time tomorrow for another interesting episode. Um, I don't really know what we're going to do tomorrow, but let's see same time tomorrow. Let's make it a surprise. Okay. Let's see same time tomorrow for another interesting episode. Please, I'm going to share this family. If you're going to use it for any purpose, no problem. Um, there is something I kind of, um, what's the name, noticed. Is if you use pick line it brings out the exact distance you used but if you used line you end up having this kind of issue you see you end up having this kind of problem but if you use pick line try as much to pick up the line and then click on it and you're not going to have any problems okay so thank you very much for watching this video let's see same time tomorrow for another Okay, sorry. Hmm. Well, let's see sometimes we will find another interesting episode. Please, guys. Okay, now I am able to pick up the line. It's getting slow. Hmm. No, it's still having this issue. So. No problem, no problem. Okay, let's see some time tomorrow for another interesting episode. Please follow me up on the videos. If it's helpful, please hit on the like button. And if you want more videos, please do subscribe to this channel. I will post a video inshallah every day if it's possible. 
And if it not, if it, if it's not, I'm going to jump from few days. Who knows? The future is undetermined. Okay. Thank you very much for watching. Goodbye for now.